Hey guys, Jared Webb back again, and this time I'm putting my brand new HX1 up against the Ultimate Bass Test. Can it hang with a Sans Amp bass driver? The classic Sans Amp, the classic bass pedal, the bass pedal you've probably heard more times than you can even count. Can this thing hang with it? Now for this test, what I did was I put the Sans Amp just set to the classic settings, everything at noon. Um, you really can't go wrong. That's just a classic, great bass sound with everything at noon. Uh, you'll see it here on the screen. Um, what I did was I went in on the settings for the Sans Amp. It's called uh, Zero Bass in here. Um, I went in and tried to set all the settings accordingly to match that all noon uh, uh, sans amp setting on that pedal so we're gonna see how they sound side by side in a little bit of a test here uh, we're gonna do finger style first uh, the style that I play in which is kind of an aggressive finger style um, then we're gonna go into with a pick um, and then finally we'll test out some slap and pop uh, thump and pluck whatever you want to call it but uh, yeah, let's get to the test and uh, let's get started. My final thoughts on the HX1, honestly, it sounds really close. Um, I got to give it to it. It sounds very close. The only thing that I've noticed with the HX1 is it does have a slightly more digital sound, um, which is kind of hard to notice to the regular person. I don't think they would notice, but to a bass player, you can definitely notice a little bit of that digital sound. Uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Um, see which one did you like more, the HX1 or the Sans Amp? As always, thank you guys for checking out my videos. I plan on doing quite a few tests with this HX1. Uh, I got a few pedals back here on my wall. I'm gonna see how many are actually on the HX1, and uh, yeah, maybe do a few more tests and uh, do them side by side again, um, and see what you guys think. I know I like it so far. I think for the price, it's pretty good. It's got 250 plus effects built into it. The only complaint though is really just the fact that it's a one block. So you can't combine any of the settings and stuff. Um, any of the effects. So you can only do one. Um, but that's also probably why it's in this price point. Um, it is using Helix tones. So that's pretty cool. Um, they do sound great. Oh, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. And until next time, cheers. <laughs>